अभी क्या नहीं था ना एक बार रीलोड जगह आज हम हाथ से हाथ लिस्ट में रीलोड कराएंगे Hagoda in the Gold District recorded the highest rainfall of 142.5 mm of rain during a 24-hour window ending at 8:30 a.m. on Thursday. Several sections of the Gold Bathikama road were inundated due to heavy rain. The Gold Karapiti road was inundated from the Beligha area, while several sections on the Gold Lapudua road were also flooded. Hill Street in Kaluthava was inundated from the Botwat area. An earth mound fell on the railway tracks near the tunnel in Valawatha in Gaul. However, the tracks were cleared and operations were restored. A person died after being struck by lightning in Mutur Kangavedi area. A correspondent said that the 48-year-old man was struck by lightning while he was working on a paddy field. Meanwhile, 11 cows have also died due to lightning strike in Arsamuripu area of Vaunia. We expect an increase in rainfall in the southwestern part of the island. The signs that this situation will continue for the next few days have subsided. However, thunderstorms will occur from time to time in the western Sabaragamur, southern, central, northwestern, and eastern provinces. But heavy rains are expected in the provinces like western Sabaragamur, central, and south. Some places are expected to receive more than 100 millimeters of rain. Temporary strong winds can also be expected. Moderate showers have been pouring in and out of Colombo throughout the entire day today here in Sri Lanka, and vehicular movement have been limited due to the rainy conditions as well. And some of the low-lying areas in Sri Lanka, especially in Colombo, have been flooded due to a certain extent as well. This is the situation here in Sri Lanka, here in Colombo, and the med department advises the people to be cautious in their movement, especially in their vehicular movement as well. Amrita Suryaraj reporting for News First.